Hello, hello, Artie friends. Here is a highlight from our live stream. Enjoy. The silver probably wouldn't have shown up much. No, not, not, not on this light background. Or no. even on the other one. Um, silver is tricky business, man. You, you need some super high contrast because otherwise it just kind of absorbs everything around it. That's kind of been my feeling. And I didn't have to wear my um, apron today because this shirt's been baptized. It has a big old blob of stuff on the back of it, which I guess I had it on backwards. I don't know how that happened. She or I sat down in the paint purpose. or something. Who like knows? Like when she first got the paint on the front side? Yeah, well, I turned it she... around to the other side. Yeah. So, so that... <laughs> now, I don't know. This is not yeah. striking me as no. terribly... Is that that blue that you just love so much? That just makes me crazy. No, it really wasn't. Is that from the pot? Oh, that's kind of cool looking. Yeah, let's take a print on that. See what we get. You know, this is what we're going to do to it uh, anyway. Brad's going to make two different butterflies to go with the current one. And he's thinking two more different ones. Yeah, uh, I think that'll be cool. Then you'll have five. Yeah, we like five. I like that. Uh, give it 45 minutes. Hey, Chris. I'm not, yeah, hello. I hope you are feeling better. I'm glad you're here. But yeah, it's like 11 p.m. Or going to be 11 p.m. their time. Oh, that's going to be quite lovely. Well, and I think this is pretty cool looking. That's cool. Because, you know, the brayer came off on the back mm -hmm. of the butterfly. And that's because it's new Yupo. You won't always get that. You won't always Just get that. Just that FYI. Yeah, that, that. Or after a while, you start getting chunks that come off. <laughs> Not necessarily something that you wanted to happen. Oh, look at that. And I like the little speckledy business. Now, again, those little holes, if you don't clean them out, they're going to be non-existent. Yeah, but they got away. And, and the big thing you want to clean out your holes with is when you use um, modeling paste. Yes. Because that'll really clog them up. I just, I love the delicacy and I love the just ephemeral quality of this butterfly. I'm, I'm going to do another one. Good job, I Brad. I really love, love, love this butterfly. <laughs> For any reason, see those little dots print out just fine. <laughs> Leave it alone, Brad. <laughs> okay. Hoping we get a little nice, some nice little brayer, funky action going on here with our. Uh, well, yeah. Guess. See, the funny thing is, is now that we're we're streaming the three times a week, um, he's getting less time to like just test the stuff stuff out behind the scenes. So you guys are getting. Yeah, you're getting behind the scenes. Yeah, this apologies. Like... Yesterday was definitely a behind the scenes. You guys enjoying that you're you're just <laughs> fortunate that i i didn't because a lot of times i will say bad words <laughs> oh. izzy's over there going sugar jj sugar <laughs> <laughs> thanks chris <laughs> it's the rare rare fran look at that good moldy green up there thank, thank you chris um yeah that's some goodness right there that is some goodness. Now, I don't know that there's enough. Oh, and Anne, see, that's a good call out, Anne. She what is it? says, you created a butterfly that is more ana anatomical than just cutesy. Yes. I like that. My, the ones that I made were kind of on the cutesy, cutesy side. And then I was like, I don't, I don't think P like... I don't really feel butterflies, honestly. I like them out in nature. And so that's why this is a good... I, I'm loving this because it almost looks like a specimen that you have. And, and I didn't have to kill it in a kill jar. There you go. It always comes back to something kind of murdery. Yep. Murdering butterflies. You don't have to do that. It's not necessary. <laughs> not necessary. You can just run over to PM Artist Studio and go to the shop and... You know, although these aren't on the shop yet. Don't run over there yet. 
Remember, these are R&D. Yeah, these are. You guys are getting the, the, the special viewing. Oh, thanks, Lyndon. Hello. And these are pretty cool little prints. I, I, I'm digging it. I am too. I just, I, I think they're, they're quite lovely. Yes, and that's what Fran feels about the flowers. Better out in nature. Oh, yes, I love some moths. Oh, seriously, when I went to summer school in Junction, um, they would do population counts on bugs. And the way that they would do them is set up this big, huge white sheet and lights. And then they would count. They didn't, I'm sure some of them died for purposes of whatever yeah. study. But most of them, they just counted them and then just left them alone to see what the population was in that, in that area. But, oh, my goodness. This one, it was like this big. Yeah. It looked like a bird. It had like the the it's big, just... isn't it the one with like the big eye looking? It, it had eye looking things on its wings. Mm -hmm. It was just absolutely stunning. Wished I, you know, I didn't have a good camera back in those days. What? Oh, let's see. Uh, I'm okay. A waiting butterfly. Okay. Oh, hey, Susan. Hi to all. She was at the local thrift store cleaning great art materials. This butterfly. Mmm, yes. Okay, another reason I need to learn to edit between my potty mouth. My husband making noises at the dog party. <laughs> yes. You hear the kitty? Yes. Uh, He's back at it. <laughs> saying, I haven't forgotten. Yeah. He's out and about. He's been let out of the room. Well, we certainly got some good things going oh, on. Oh, the wings could work with Sharon's angels. Yes, definitely. Oh, and then Debsy, I sure hope today is part of ratings weeks because this looks like quite the show today. Oh, thanks, Deb. Deb, she's so sweet. All right, hey, Kitty. Don't you. He came with intent. <laughs> he did. He's gonna, I'm going to jump up there and screw all this up. With you. Jump on your keyboard and see what you think about that. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, kitty. That was a loud one. I know. Oh, look at this. Look how it went off. Oh, that. and I love the mix of this splotchy blue. And All right, cat's going to take him back to his daddy. Come on. Well, cover him up with a comforter. That's what he really likes. You Watch. bury him under there. He's, he's like, well, you know, it's like children. Take them a little while to get out. never really tried to do that before but have it purposefully come off the page I scared Van <laughs> oh that's a real show for sure <laughs> oh Luna moth yes oh yes those are huge at this we need all oh an owl stencil I don't know about owls my dad always liked owls, didn't he? He was really yes. into owls. He was very much into owls. Kind of odd. We have, remember we had that one painting. Oh, yeah. Well, it wasn't a painting. It was a print. Yeah. Let's see here. This is what I miss. Ooh, Chris made a quilt with moths. Not like out of moths. I'm assuming. Look. Not a yep. real ones, yeah. I was going to say, I don't know if you could watch that or not. <clears throat> I need some love on this. Oh, okay, yes. Can we get some... You know, she wants some gooey eyes and whatnot. Come on now, folks. <laughs> that is really pretty. And see, they're talking to each other. Yeah. Hey, hey. This is the mommy and this is the baby. Just, where have you been? Or this one's really close to you and that yes. one's far away. There you go. That's probably the truer story. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed the highlight. For the full link replay, click this end screen. Be sure to sub and ring the bell to be notified every time we go live.